Hi, I'm Becca from Assay Genie. Today I'm going to talk to you about cell-based ELISA kits. At Assay Genie, we have developed over 1,600 cell-based ELISA kits for phosphorylated and cellular proteins. This range of ELISA kits was developed in response to the current challenges faced by researchers, which include the time-consuming and laborious procedure associated with Western blotting. Western blotting is also highly impractical for screening large numbers of samples. The cell-based ELISA kits provide a convenient solution as they detect the relative amount of proteins in situ. The benefits of no more Western blotting or lysate preparation steps allows rapid, high-throughput detection. The main features of the cell-based ELISA kit range include high throughput and no more Western blots. Rapid procedure as screening in situ with no lysate preparation means a saving of 24 hours per experiment. The kits are adaptable, allowing researchers to analyze proteins in adherent and suspension cells. Additionally, the kits are highly sensitive and specific and utilize highly validated antibodies. Finally, the kits are also great for drug discovery for screening the effects of inhibitors or activators on cellular or phosphorylated proteins. Cell-based ELISA have a simple protocol. Step 1 You add your cells to the plate. Step 2 You treat with inhibitors or activators. Step 3 You quench, fix, and block. Step 4 You add your primary antibody and your control secondary antibody. Step 5 You add dye 1 and dye 2 conjugated secondary antibodies. And finally, step six, you read on a fluorometer. There are over 1,600 targets available across our cell-based and cell-based phosphorylation ELISA kits. Some of our most popular targets include AKT, NF-kappa-B, mTOR, ICAM-1, and P53. To view the full list of cell-based ELISA kits, visit assayjuni.com forward slash cell-based ELISA kits. To find out more and learn about our other key technologies, you can find us online at assayjuni.com or any other social platform, including LinkedIn, Instagram, and Twitter. Thanks for watching.